Kenneth Doris, a Smokayam Alternative School student, was quick to praise improvements to Soap Lake Skate Park. Way better, by far. Soap Lake business owners Tom and Sue Rawls led the skate park improvement project. The Rawls, who own Soap Lake Yacht Club, a paddleboard and kayak rental shop, pulled together a team of community volunteers. They moved several skateboard trick ramps from the town of Almira, about 40 miles away. Almira closed its skate park to expand other park facilities. It took four trips, a donated forklift, and three trailers to haul all the equipment to the facility at Smokayam Park, formerly East Beach. Some of the ramps, such as the half pipe, were accepted as is with the idea of upgrading them later. Kenneth said he would be willing to pitch in to fix the ramps and even raise money needed to do the job. We could probably do something like fundraisers or something because they're, they're going to need about $3,000 or something to fix it because all the wood is rotted. Project leader Tom Rawls says it's now up to Soap Lake's leaders and skate park users to come forward and add the finishing touches to the park's equipment. The deck has to be rebuilt on that half pipe because of the fact that uh, it was just made out of just uh, two by sixes that weren't uh, outdoor grade. So we're gonna, when we put it back together, we're gonna use outdoor grade material and it'll last uh, a lot longer. The Rawls say they are grateful to those volunteers who helped them move the skate park components. I had about, I uh, had uh, five people from the fire department. I had uh, uh, two, four, six, two people from the food bank, uh, several pri private parties that helped. Uh, there was like uh, three or four private parties that helped, uh, three trailers and uh, one person uh, loaned us another car hauler trailer, so they gave us three trailers on the initial uh, part of the move. Before the Rawls effort, the park wasn't much more than a large concrete slab, a metal ramp, and a small rail. Well, the people uh, of Soap Lake were excited to get it. You can see that we got quite a few kids down here today, and there's been, a, a, with the kids, it's great for them, so it kind of gives them some place to come and hang out and uh, practice skateboarding. Maybe they're one of these days they'll be like a Tony Hawk or something. Who knows? I'm Jeff Chu for iFiber One News.